weekly creative update. Hello, 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 and welcome to the show. Welcome to your favorite YouTube show. My name is Carl, and I'm going to be your host today. I am an artist, and here on YouTube, I share my artistic journey. So, very, very welcome to the show. It's another Sunday. And we will be rolling on. Today I don't have my pink post-it notes because I couldn't find them. I have some beige one here. But uh, first of all, let me introduce the hat. The hat, look at it. It's a new hat because it's a new month. This is the hat of March. What do you think? What do you think? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. This is the March hat and this is the sun hat. Uh, with a little sun on top and the beam spreading out, going o going over the edge, one one uh, one and a half centimeters. There's really really nice. I enjoy it so much. Shout out to Olivia who made it. I made a design. She made a hat. It was a nice collaboration. Uh, so this will be the hat of March. I will wear it until the month out, so to speak. April will be a new hat, but for now, let's get on with the show. Just a little fun introduction with a hat. So, what is actually going on? What is going on? What am I working on? I am working right now on an exhibition coming up in Lund, the neighbor town. I live in Malmö, Sweden, and it's the Super Secret Seeds. Uh, and I'm doing other things as well. I just had to think here. Uh, keeping it real. Uh, the next thing is another show uh, close to Umeå in the north of Sweden. Another show coming up. I carry berries. And uh, then there is this public sketch mission. A public art piece for a school. Which I'm going to present to the municipality in the beginning of April. And then there is a new little fun thing has come up on the schedule. It's a new exhibition in the town where I live, Malmö, in the beginning of August. So there's a lot of nice things going on. Uh, but zoom in on the details. Let's dive deeper into it. What have I actually been working on this, uh, this week? It's the Super Secret Seeds because that is the exhibition coming up closest here. So let's roll some pictures on that. I have made... Uh, one, two, two drawings, a little larger textile piece, and a relief for a sculpture that will be hanging in a window. Uh, so uh, in the beginning of the week, I was really productive there. I had uh, had it flowing, and later on to the weeks, now it's it's been slowing off. But I'm pleased with uh, what I have produced here so far. That is actually not many pieces left to to make for that uh, exhibition. Uh, it's some small drawings. I have been experimenting here with uh, with. Uh, I bought some plastic uh, plastic uh, sheets to have paper in, and I was uh, I thinking because this, there's a lot of yellow in that exhibition, and here I made um, made some sort of drawing and tried it out. Uh, uh, I'm probably gonna frame them like this on the wall. I'm always looking for new th new ways to produce, uh, to present work, and uh, fun fun little mediums to that I can use, uh, which is also cheap. So I bought uh, six six pieces of plastic folders, and those were two cr Swedish crowns each. So uh, really cheap, uh, which is nice, uh, and uh, it's reused because it was in a second hand store, which is nice. Uh, so I will be doing six drawings next week and some small relief pieces, not not that large, and maybe some small sculptures. So next week probably I'm all finished up with that uh, with that exhibition with everything that's going into it. Uh, let's also show a, a little the poster I made for it. This this was the poster I made for it. I'm I I I like graphic design. I'm getting more into that. I I want to learn Illustrator. I want to become better at Illustrator. Uh, but this um, it's nice. It's nice practice to do your own, own posters. I I want to dive deeper into that into the future when the time comes where I can do that. For the next 
thing that I worked on was the public sketch sketch mission. Uh, but I really didn't do that much creative work because the most of the creative work is done and now it's really getting into the budget uh, and stuff with the money and trying to solve I, 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 I'm going to have this amount of, of the budget and uh, the materials are going to cost this and this and uh, what else have we like some insurance and uh, other boring stuff like that but it needs to be done it has to be done and I'm trying to figure it out. But there isn't much left in the presentation now here to do. It is, I will do some, some physical models to show at the meeting, to show at the presentations. And uh, there I will have to put in my architectural skills to show a really, really nice model, a really nice rep representation of the thing I want to do with the school on the facade and on the fence where the art pieces are gonna be shown. So that will be happening next week uh, and that will be fun. I can really really take advantage of my skills, mo model making skills there, uh, which will be exciting to see where it will lead and I will have a f I have a friend shout out to you Pedro if you're watching this you said yes to helping me to laser cut a little piece for that uh, which I am really grateful for because I don't have a laser cutter and that's expensive and he's going to architecture school last semester now that you really have to to take uh, take use of the uh, laser cutter there let's move on that what uh, that's what i made in the week uh, but uh, i also made a little youtube fun video just a small one uh, i named it uh, take aware not not take aware be aware of uh, opportunities because it was a leap year and it was 29th 29th of february and then i put it out because it was just fun uh, so I made that as well. That was probably the creative part of the week. And then over to another fun thing here. It is the Discord, the Discord channel. Uh, with the community that is building up with you guys. You are tuning in right now. We are a little over 60. I think there was 64 the last time I checked. And people are getting into it. People are writing, they're sharing their artwork, they're having discussions and it is a really nice space to be. Uh, I need to be there more. Uh, I haven't uh, done that much there, but I will have to dive deeper into that. I probably have to do updating that uh, the little Carl CCCC, uh, Carl's community, uh, Carl's creative community cult. Of course, it is called like that. But uh, I will really, as a cult leader, com uh, community leader, um, uh, I will have to go in there. I will have to go in there and uh, see that everything is running properly and that it is constantly developing. But uh, right now, people seem to have a good time and I will jump in there and uh, maybe take some calls or maybe have a little fun discussion here. Let me know what you want to do there because I'm not really sure about what to do. But I will probably have to th figure something out and we, we can see where it will lead probably to some fun and engaging conversations and right now I don't even know because I'm not prepared I'm not prepared this is one of the first times I will have to cut because you know what it's the weekly question but I have not looked up I have not been prepared so see you when I have the question ready Okay, so I am back here uh, with the weekly question coming up first, just to make this uh, this moment a little more enjoyable. I'm gonna light up a little candle from the candle holder made from Sensitive Goyu Conference, a little collective of mine that I have together with the hat maker of this hat. Let's go into it let's get into the question here this is a deep one this is a, an exciting one uh, we'll see maybe i i will shed a tear i will try not to shed a tear or something but let's get into it weekly question hey carl uh, and i need to say it is from 
Mona Renegadelisa. Probably did not pronounce that right. Sorry for that, but let's get into it. Weekly question. Hey, Carl. Have you ever experienced hard judgment and criticism from people when you decided to be an artist? How did you deal with it? I really enjoy your show. Thank you so much for enjoying the show. I enjoy having you here. But of course I have that. I can get into that into a personal level here. Uh, We will see where it leads. But uh, my parents cannot understand it. They cannot understand why I want to do what I want to do. Why I want to be an artist. They are saying... Now you have an education, Carl. You have educated yourself to become an architect for five years. And then you're not even going to work as one. You're going to go and do other things. Um, And they cannot get into their minds why I'm doing what I'm doing. Uh, And then uh, I'm trying to tell it, but uh, it's... um, it's hard, you know, it's hard, uh, but uh, I just want, um, uh, I'm uh, I'm just doing doing it for the love of it, of course, uh, and uh, to get back to that, uh, to that thing, uh, I don't think they realize that architecture school is a lot, or what, a lot of like what I do now in, in the way of working and the way of, of finding ideas, inspiration and doing artwork. Uh, and I've always been uh, working really uh, when I was in the, the architecture scene or in the school or, or stuff like that. I, uh, I've always worked uh, sculptural, really, really sculptural and, and, and trying to break new ways of working in, in that field and trying to look away from the traditional and do something of my own creations uh, but it is hard for people to to understand and i think it's hard for other people as well to 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 see what i'm doing uh, and i, I i'm o- i've always said like uh, Work is not for me. Uh, I have some friends uh, and they, they just laugh at it because work, regular work is not for me because uh, I find it so boring and I, I don't find it inspirational uh, and I don't re- really enjoy doing what people are telling me to do. Uh, so that is why I'm trying to do this thing, doing my own thing. Uh, and I'm so really, really, really glad that every one of you are so uh, so joyful and spiritful and uh, uh, and uh, giving all this positive feedback back because I love it. I love to be here and I love to do my own thing. Uh, hope that answers some of the question. It is a hard question. It, it, it is a loaded question uh, and probably I got off track there. But um, I, I, the way to deal with it is just to... To be proud in yourself and to to don't let the norms or society or the people that don't understand let them don't understand and try to to just be true to yourself and do what you like. I know it's really really hard. It's really hard for me still to to do the things that I do when a lot of people around you don't get it they don't get anything they think you're some uh, weird weird bowl bow bowl uh, weird weird little uh, ball ro- rolling around doing nothing i i think uh, seems like um, people are thinking of this and not wanting to work uh, and see you as a slacker slacker chiller uh some something in that way uh but let's move on that was a long little question i'm gonna keep the candle burning for the spirit and love of creating art. This is a long one. This is a long one. I am just loving it. And it's uh, getting into getting into deep stuff here. The next one is uh, an exciting one. It's a little new one. It is... I've been thinking about starting a Patreon. Uh, and I don't really know even what that is. But uh, uh, it's uh, a little super secret behind the scenes kind of thing. Uh, I don't really have a a direction, but I need to say it here. uh, Then I'm going to start it up uh, and uh, I will see where it leads. I will put up some some things there uh, and uh, some things are going to be behind a little 
wall, paywall doesn't sound that nice, but it's probably not not not, not gonna cost that much. But uh, it will help supporting me making a living as an artist. Uh, you always have to find ways to do it, and that's one of the ways. Uh, so we'll we'll see where it leads. But I can promise you some fun stuff behind the scene, some uh, some interviews after the show, uh, me interviewing me and explaining what I felt about the show and stuff like that. That could be one thing, a little video behind the video and maybe some tutorials or a come with suggestion. What would you like to see in the Patreon? Maybe even some more uh, real roar stuff there. Uh, not that uh, not that fancy, but uh, fun and enjoyable. Hopefully the Patreon is coming up and it will be under the works for a bit, and uh, I will probably launch it now. I'm putting a link down here so you can so you can go in and check it out. But um, that's gonna be starting up, which will be fun, and we'll see where it leads. Of course, uh, you never know where it leads. Everything it everything is an experiment. Uh, but uh, for now, let's get over to you, Carl. Thank you so much for that, Carl. Lovely to see that you have a new hat. I would love to have uh, my own someday. Uh, an update reader hat. But for now, this is exciting things. This is exciting stuff. Because we're wrapping up the six-month period. See what goals I reach or what I didn't reach. And... Uh, start to sketch on some new goals for for a new little period of trying to improve myself and trying to do the work that I'm supposed to be doing. But let's get through it. Followers on Instagram did not reach the goal. The goal was 2000. I ended up on 1937. So really, really close. Uh, which means that I can say that it was a success. Almost a success. But uh, it was a B, not an A, a B. Next one, subscribers on YouTube. The goal was 100. And at right now, 4,018. Thank you very much for that. The goal well achieved. A lot over what I expected or what was the intentional goal. So thank you so much for that. Love you to Ev love you to everyone. Loves love sending out to everyone that is watching this channel. But if you're watching and you're not subscribing, what are you doing, guys? Subscribe to the show, uh, and uh, you will enjoy it because um, microphone is on. Right, 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 right. Uh, because everyone is loving it. Everyone is enjoying it. Everyone is, seems to having a good time here. It is spotlight instead of a spotlight of a Sunday. Apply for competitions, scholarships, and grants. Also, the goal was achieved. The goal was to apply for 100, but I did apply for 160. So the box is green there. Post on Instagram twice a week. The goal was 50. I did 51. So the goal was achieved there as well. Really nice. Good job to myself. Create these videos. The goal was 25. I ended up at 24, so almost, I think I missed two weeks, uh, but I didn't get down on that, and I didn't miss them con uh, consecu consecutively, consecu oh, cannot talk, I cannot even talk English, but that's why I'm trying, that's why I'm doing the show, that's trying to improve, but I didn't miss two in a row, uh, which is the point, if you miss two in a row, then it can get scary, because um, then you're getting out of routine, one is fine, two is not fine. Almost achieved that goal. The next one is be a part of exhibitions. The goal was five and I achieved three there. So uh, pretty close, 66%. Which I will have to say uh, is okay. Or is it even 66%? It's not, it's 60%. Uh, sorry for my math. Sell things for 15,000 Swedish crown. I ended up at selling things for 6,500. So not so close there, but... People maybe don't have the money. People don't know of me. That's because I'm trying to share the love for myself and spreading my name, trying to get uh, people to know me, get to know me and get to know my art. And when you have an audience, then maybe people, a big, larger audience, then maybe people will start to buy. But we'll see there. Uh, money is not everything, but it's a way of living on. 
it's a way of the world, you know. Have to have it. Boring stuff to talk about. Uh, release products. Oh, I had a plan to release some products. I made a little bowl. And I was planning on making six products. I made one. And also made a video of it. So you can check it out on the channel. And the last thing that I had was creative love letters. Where I sent out some inspirational notes on Instagram to people. That I admired, uh, which I admire their, their work, their uh, their creations, uh, and, and the goal was to send out fifty of these letters. I sent out thirty-two, so not that good there. But a lot of a lot of letters sent out, and people seemed they they, they were they were happy. They really enjoyed it, and uh, that was nice. So. For the six month period, this was uh, coming up out of me having the money to sustain myself for doing six months of uh, trying to live as a full time artist. And uh, now I have made some more money, uh, some exhibition money coming in, some uh, sketch mission proposal money coming in, uh, which, uh, allow, uh, which allows me to keep going and uh, having uh, now I only have money for three months more. Uh, and after that period, we will see. Hopefully, I have more money and I can continue doing this stuff because I love it. But uh, I will have to set up some new goals, uh, which I don't know what they're going to be exactly. But I have some sketches here. I'm going to tell them really quick. And next time, we, we will know for sure what the goal is. But it will be until the period of 1st of March. Not really 1st of March. But let's say, let's just say that for the for the sake of it. For the for the easy 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 um, counting there. From March until the last 1st of March until the last of May. Three months. And I will have some new exciting goals. I've written down some uh, sketch goals here. Uh, YouTube subscribers. I want to reach 5,000. And I think that is possible. And on Instagram. I want to reach 2,500 followers. Hopefully that also is possible. And for this is a fun thing. I, uh, I'm i trying to be open-minded. I'm, I'm really trying to be that every time and really be curious and stuff. And I haven't explored the really short media. Really short media, which everyone is... I don't really like to consume it because uh, I think it can be scary. But uh, I have, have not tried to create it myself. So I'm going to try to be done with the kids. I'm going to try to do some... TikTok videos, T TikTok videos of me creating a little, some small process videos, just to try to explore my creativity and my my filmmaking, and trying to be myself, trying to be real, try to to keep me in it, and don't try to be influenced by what other people are doing in that media. I'm not, I'm not on TikTok. I haven't really even watched those kind of videos, so I, I don't really know what the flow of things are. So I'm just gonna be doing doing my thing and trying to put that spin on it uh, and trying to do fun short videos of me as a little um, surreal surreal work diary there. You can follow me, uh, I haven't, uh, maybe I have put up one video when you see this. It's just the same. Call Frederick Emmerich on TikTok. Follow me there and we will see where it leads. I will hopefully put out one video every week of a fun, surreal, work diary kind of style video. We will see. Trying to, trying to keep open-minded and trying to be... Uh, to not let... Uh, to be this kind of... I am an artist. I'm only making precious work and uh, trying to be uh, pretentious about everything. Uh, I'm trying to keep with the flow, going with the flow, and trying to be exploring things that I have not explored because everything is leading to somewhere and somewhere is leading to somewhere and uh, everything is connected. We'll see about that. It will be fun. <laughs> it will be fun. Sell things for 10,000 crowns, which means I need to sell Swedish crowns. I need to sell stuff for 3,333 crowns every month here. And hopefully I can do that. I will be trying to pushing out things. Uh, I have uh, made a lot of small posters for uh, exhibitions here that I had and small drawings and some people have ordered, which is really nice. I'm going to do some shout outs. Farron and Jay, for example, they bought a poster, they bought a drawing and I can send it to you if you want it. Some I'm just going to show some of th those here. But uh, if you want to buy something, 
reach out. You know where to reach me. You know where I stay here on the internet. You know my name. You know my name, for God's sake. And uh, then creative love letters. I want to continue on that. And I want to send out 20 love letters. I think that's a possibility. I, I think I can do that. And it's the preparation. I want to prepare the Patreon that I talked about earlier. I want to set it up. I want to have some nice behind the scenes stuff. I want to have some more personal stuff. I want to to go into the deep there. And if you like to follow me there, just hit me up here. I don't know what it's going to cost. Maybe five to ten bucks or something a month. And then you will have access to a lot of fun, really cool stuff. So if you want to sign up, you can already maybe do it now. I'm going to leave the link down below. If, you, if you're watching this video later, I will probably have it up and running. And it will be really fun. And we will share, share and have a really nice community there. And uh, it will be a little more in team maybe and uh, and cool cool and crazy cool crazy stuff can be going on there that's what i had in the sketchbook for for what i could have for some new goals if you have some uh, suggestions leave it in the comments what should be a proper goal what should i strive for in this next three month period where i can only focus on my artistic work because i have the money for it to sustain, to pay the rent and to buy some materials and stuff. Hopefully another scholarship will ring on the door and say, hey, Carl, here you have a little scholarship. But we will see. Uh, I think this is exciting. I think this is exciting. But for now, we will just go back to the show. Back to you, Carl. Thank you so much for that. And we will see what we will do about the hat situation there. Probably you can... Uh, you can probably get one of those updater hats in the soon future. But really exciting with uh, with a new project coming up, three month period. Uh, that's gonna be exciting. And now we're gonna end the show on some wise words. What are those gonna be today? It's gonna be come into that uh, maybe touch on some of the weekly question as well it's about i'm trying to be real i'm trying to be real i'm trying to be me i'm trying to to just be myself and i i, I encourage you to ju just be yourself just be real and authentic it's so um, it's such a cliche such a cliche of saying but it is true it is so so true you have to you really have to be yourself and, and trust in yourself and be the way you are. I've been scared for that uh, in some way uh, of a, a larger part of my life. So, so that's something you have to work with all of the time to just try to to just try to do it. To just try to be yourself. And it's a lot of work. It takes a lot of work. It take, takes a lot of courage. Uh, but when you finally do that and put yourself out there and uh, in, in this on this channel we, we're talking about this artistically and uh, trying to express yourself uh, uh, through visual uh, visual as a visual artist as a, a, as a creator of visual arts but uh, it it can be vulnerable of course it is vulnerable uh, but when you do it and when you feel like you really or yourself, it's, it's much more enjoyable to live. It's much more enjoyable to be a person, a human being, if you just try to be real, try to be <laughs> real and show what you really are made of. And that's, uh, I really, I, I'm really trying to do that with this show, to just uh, keep it real, trying to keep it transparent and just uh, not, uh, that's why I'm not, uh, I'm not editing, I'm not cut, uh, cutting in the video show, putting up, Life isn't polished, and that's what I'm trying to do here, a show here. And uh, life is uh, a long experiment. Life is a long process, uh, and it uh, it's something you will work on your whole life. And that's what I find uh, I find so exciting. It's just about showing up every day and doing <laughs> your best. And uh, I I really think that's that's a gift to 
to try to have that uh, insight or trying to think that way that things can't be perfect. But just try to be yourself, try to keep it real, and I think a lot of things will come to you because you really are trying. You have to try to do that. It's a lot of... It feels like a, it's a hard work to put yourself out there to do those things, but it's so important. But for now, this is over. Let's do this. The show is over for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. This was a long one. This was a lovely one. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Tell everyone, tell your friends, your family, your lovers, your teachers, your... Uh, everyone you know about this show because we're making it happen. We're making it real. We're making the world's best art community. We are doing it together for the love of it for the love of the game for the love of the art thank you thank you very much bye bye